Hey YouTube, uh, this is my next episode of uh, More Creepy Pasta. Today I'm going to be watching the supposed video of the Grifter. Now, if you've read mostly any any place about the Grifter, it was uh, it was kind of like a spam email that came up in people's inboxes, and it was a video that when you watch it, you would supposedly feel sick, or you would pass out, or you would even kill yourself, or kill other people. But um, many people have trolled others on the uh, the X board. I think that's what it's called. X. It's kind of like 4chan, but it's like the paranormal section of 4chan. And um, yeah, I'm kind of butchering this. I apologize. But it was basically, you know, what you'd expect a creepy pasta to be. Like if it involved a video, the video would make people crazy, or it'd make them kill themselves, kill other people make them do horrible things but I mean now no matter who you ask they're always just like oh that shit's fake and it was even admitted by the person that created this video that it's fake this is just a fan made video it's supposed to be based off of the story so we're gonna watch it right now now I haven't watched it yet even though I watched the uh there's another video that I'm gonna show after this it's where all the clips from this video supposedly came from I never saw this video yet but We'll see if that's true afterward. Um, let's just take a look at this. I'll just describe what I see, because maybe, maybe you could see it from the camera, but you know, my angle's kind of weird, so the LCD is a little weird. But let's play it. All right, it's it's a dark hall, hands, an eye maggots all over a floor it looks like a weird face just popped out walking down the hallway again turning down the court there's another weird picture jumping out some weird stuff happening again walking down the hallway looks like it's approaching a room just jump cutted Still going down the hallway. Another jump cut. Another jump cut. Oh. A baby crying. A meat cleaver. Old guy. Some text. Some weird language. I wonder if something's going to pop out. That's usually what these videos are. And that says Suicide Mouse and Dead Bart. Well, I guess that person also, uh, Oh, and you gotta love how ads are on a haunted video, too. Ah, uh, that's always fun. Anyway, that's the first time I ever saw that. Now, it's pretty weird stuff. I mean, there was, like, a stuff popping out. Um, it's in a dark room the entire time. Or dark hallway or corridor. Whatever. But, I read somewhere, I think it was on knowyourmeme.com. I'll look for a link and post it. Um, it, it looked... Like, from what I saw from The Grifter, it had, like... Now, I actually watched this beforehand, and I didn't watch The Grifter. I watched this, though. And it, some of the stuff did look familiar, especially the baby. So, just just as a means of comparison, let's take a look. This is a trailer for a movie called Little Otik. It's... Um, I'll let it, the trailer describe it. There's the baby from the, uh, the grifter. There's the eye. Definitely recognize that. That guy. That brain looked familiar. Yes. That I think that's all that. Yeah, the goggle that that was definitely in there. That was in there. That was in there. That I don't know if that was in there.
And that's the trailer for a movie called Little Otik. It's it's based on a children's story, I think. Uh, it's based on some kind of story where this this married couple physically can't have a baby because of birth complications. So they but they really want a child. So they build themselves a child out of the out of a tree stump. The tree stump becomes animated because they, they treat it like a real a real baby, and it, it starts growing and then it eats people. So that's that's what that movie's about. And it appears that the grifter took a lot of elements from that trailer. Well, it it, it did because it, like I before I even saw this video, I read stories about it because unlike my last episode, I just kind of pontificated and I didn't. I didn't know much of the story, so I made sure I actually knew what I was I was doing this time. Now, obviously, stuff like this is fake, but depending on how good it looks, that usually gets people scared, and therefore they're entertained by it. But this one, I mean, it looked pretty good, but once you know the backstory, it, it, it loses all of its. Uh, it, it probably would have been scary if people didn't see this, but. As soon as more grifter threads kept popping up on uh, the paranormal forum in uh, 4chan, I think it's called X. But um, as soon as those like forums started popping up again with the grifter, people would just link it to this and say, you know, it's it's fake. But other than that, it, it looks pretty good. It's it's pretty, you know, very nice editing. I was expecting more to pop up actually. Now that I think about it, it's kind of disappointing. But, um, anyway, that was, that's it for now. Um, my next episode is probably going to be, uh, well, I haven't decided on what it was going to be yet. It might be another video, though. So, if you guys like this, uh, just leave a comment. If you didn't like it, leave a comment, whatever. If you have any suggestions for stuff I should review next, uh, go for it. Until then, thanks for watching.